welcome once again to another episode and on this show guys we talk about things that we did as kids we are the will family by the way before we get started we would like to tell you guys make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel so on this week's episode what we're going to talk about is something very fascinating i bet you you guys have never done this before so what we did as kids we made a swing set tent now this is what a swing set tent is imagine you have that big swing the triangle looking thing you throw some sheets over it but my sister yvette is going to start off and going and going to tell us a little bit more about it and then we're all going to chime in on, on it so uh yvette go ahead and talk about the swing set tip yeah so this swing set was made by our sister ramona uh she was always very creative and uh she had this idea to make a tent out of our swing set and what she did is she took a bunch of sheets and she um she tied them together i guess she I, we're not exactly remember exactly how she did it but we we um think what you could what she probably did is that she put one sheet on like on the uh front of the of the swing set and one on the back and then at the top tied the two corners uh you know each uh, each of the corners together and then maybe at the bottom you know she she tied it to each of the corners to the to the bottom of each of those poles so you had a you had a tent we we also thought maybe she used clothes pins because you know we had a we had a clothes line in our in our backyard and so we had we had a lot of clothes pins available so she probably connected the sheets that way but she used a bunch of sheets she tied them together she connected them some kind of way and ended up making a tent from our swing set well i tell you that was a really great invention like i still remember i think it was a saturday night when she made it and i was like what is she doing because like you said she was always creative and she was always doing something next thing i know i saw this big tent and then we all were playing in it and so on so uh greg you want to mention anything about the swing set tent i know one thing when she made it she had us working and telling her everything we decided, <laughs> we decided that we're gonna sleep in it that night but <laughs> you we get terrified <laughs> 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 and and joe do you remember the swing set ten, or were you trying to avoid it <laughs> I, I don't remember it too much i think because she was because y'all being a younger sibling i think she needed y'all you know to do things and I, and I might have been involved in something else you know at the time but uh maybe i don't remember it. i don't remember or something yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah but that but i tell you the the thing i liked about it and yvette said some of this is that so imagine you have sheets on each side let's put your big swing set guys you have uh sheets on each side of it so there's like it's like you got a big roof or a big house or something and then of course you could enter it from either side of the swing set so you're going under that actual upside down v if you want to call it that way and there's like a split there so you open it up and you enter it and so and imagine it's dark you know like let's say you're doing it at night like when we did it and then we had a little fun we, we didn't have we didn't have the internet back then guys so we couldn't play like our ipad or nothing like that so you know but we probably played some music we probably maybe brought in some cd or cassette walkman you know back then and <laughs> played our music in it. We had that then. <laughs> we didn't have that either. we had pocket radios <laughs> and walkie-talkies <laughs> do, do be careful though guys because when you're making something like this uh let's say you decide to have a little fire you know because a lot of people when they go camping or whatever they're gonna have their little campfire you know just don't have your campfire close to it because you don't want to burn the cloud and start a fire or anything so if you do decide to do a campfire like if you maybe you're doing this in your backyard maybe have the campfire you know what would we say 10 feet away or something like that is that what Smokey the bear would say so maybe 10 20 feet away but just make sure that but but it's really good because imagine because think about it, when you have a regular tent tents are small and i'm not putting down any companies that make tents because i own some tents myself but tents are small some most tents 
you got to crawl in them. You could walk in this tent. It's a swing set. That's not the size of a swing set, guys. That's something huge. It's like what? What a swing set is? 10 feet tall or something? So yeah, you something you like open that. that crowd and you up there, you chilling inside of it. So you could you could fit comfortably, probably what, 10, 12 people in it, sitting down, just chilling, playing mm -hmm. games or whatever. And um, and now for our floor, I don't remember if Ramona actually made an actual floor. Maybe she put some cloth down there. You could do that. You know, just couldn't put some blankets down there, whatever, just to kind of have your little floor, just kind of, you know, relax. You know, you could probably bring in some little mini tables and get more creative and bring in some little, you know, beach chairs or something like that or folding chairs. And then, you know, you could just have some fun, you know, do what you want to do. Do something, something you would normally do when, do when you're camping. And then, of course, you could be more creative. You don't have to do everything everybody do, like making s'mores or whatever when you're camping, but you could do some other things. So, do you guys actually remember that night when we made it? Anybody want to talk about it? I just remember the time, like, like Greg said, that we, we tried sleeping in it and then we got scared. <laughs> so, we, ended up, we never slept, actually slept in it. We went back in the house because we were too scared. <laughs> We enjoyed it during the day. <laughs> <laughs> I remember it mainly at night. And like I said, my memory is it was a Saturday night that we, when we did it. So it was a Saturday night. I mean, from, like I said, gone by my memory. And when we did it, um, we just actually had fun. And we were just, I don't know if we were playing music, whatever. But I just remember when Ramona put that thing together, I'm like, what is this? I'm like, is she from Egypt or something? I mean, building a pyramid? Because because I had never seen nothing like that. And it was fascinating just to watch it, to have this huge tent. Because like I said before, most tents are small. You got to crawl in them. And, you know, in most tents, there are some bigger tents, of course. You know, but that was just a really good super invention. And imagine, so for those of you that have a swing set, you have it right there in your backyard so you don't have the actual swings that you swing on you can take those off if you can you know so for kids that's doing it of course let the parents take those off and then that way you have the sheets over the whole swing set and then you're just having a nice you know backyard camping adventure you know if you will so that's the thing so you know it's um that, I just thought that was a really cool invention. And, you know, and we as the wheels, we were always doing something crazy. <laughs> so anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. And like I said before, make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll be back with another episode. Stay tuned.